Okay, uh, getting ready for round number nine, the last round of the Swiss. Um, a lot of seven ones. Looks like there's one person that somehow has better tiebreakers than us, so hopefully that doesn't create issues for us. You know, I definitely feel safer in my top eight if uh won this round Luris deck probably hammer at this stage of things <sighs> don't really expect to see a lot of other Luris decks at seven one Jungler's okay. Well, good for them. Opponent getting a treasure. Hopefully they don't have like cake me and beer. That would be pretty rough. Dryad, I imagine. We have a bunch of threats, so it just makes sense to take the ramp. Peace. Pretty big goif. I'm gonna just hope I'm not dead, play Amulet, play Valakut, plan on Primeval Tightening next turn. Uh, I'm dead to a lot of things, but... I think this is the play that gives me the best odds. kills right now. Probably also dead to lots of other, just any sort of removal on our Titan. Okay, well this is beatable. Kinda wanna get Azusa, honestly. I think Azusa's a little bit better. So, we'll play Azusa. We're gonna haste our Titan. Thank you. 
Um, so do I want to go face or do I want to go to the Ren? So what makes a difference? I guess if I go face and they draw Culligan's Command, then it's pretty bad for me. Can I beat a Culligan's Command? So let's say they draw, Col if I attack Ren, they draw Culligan's Command. They Culligan's Command and kill Azusa. I have to block the Goyf anyway. I'm probably just losing. Yeah, I don't think I can beat that. I'm just gonna go face, get a Radiant Fountain. I guess I something removal spell for Azusa. Okay, what removal spells could they have for Azusa? They could have like abrupt decay. Abrupt decay on Azusa. I have to block Goy if I lose anyway. Yeah, I don't think I can beat a removal spell, so I think just making sure I'm killing them next turn. Maybe I should have gone at Ren and then played Karn. And then, like, Karn plussed on the amulet. That would have been a pretty smart play. It also would have shut down the spell bomb. Yeah, that would have been a better play. Okay. So what am I doing here? I'm getting Radiant Fountain. And I guess Sun Home. Because if they answer... I don't know what they would answer amulet with. I'm just dead to everything. That's that's just the situation. But yeah, the better play would have been to attack Titan into Ren and Six, get two bounce lands, play Karn. That would have shut off the draw on my heal spell bomb. And the plus on Amulet would have given me an extra blocker. Thinking for a long time seems good for me. I feel like if I was dead, they wouldn't have to think this long. I mean, I guess maybe they could have an unholy heat and they're thinking about the fact that, like, I could, like, have multiple titans. Okay, let's see that answer for primeval titan. Yeah, I mean, there's no reason to not go all in. They... they either have an answer or they don't.
Yeah, this is not enough toughness to survive. Okay. Endurance, endurance, Bajuka Bog, EE, -E, Karkarn, Kanazusa. Cut a cavern, cut a saga. I think there's a lot of value to the single engineered explosives in the deck as a transmute target. Uh, this hand just loses to discard spells and Alpine Moon. Sure. I can live with this. Draw. I'm going to play the Sanctuary out. I don't have much faith in Amulet being a reliable thing. I just need lands. Ideally, they would play out another one drop here. Goyf, okay. So I'll just play the Dryad. There's a good chance we want to cast this Engineered Explosives for two now. We also might want a Summoner's Pact for Endurance at some point. See what they take with this Inquisition. I imagine they're taking the engineered explosives, but they might take the Summoner's Pact. Yeah, this seems, this all seems sensible. Not gonna do any blocks here. I like having these creatures, especially like if I drew Karn. I'm just going to make a Saga t token to chunk the Coif right now. Just because getting to play Primeval Titan next turn would be very good. I should have played the T-West before fetching to play around like Abrupt Decay on the Amulet.
We're gonna get Vichuka Bog Simic Growth Chamber. Okay, so what did they do with the top card? They left it on top. I could Summoner's Pact for Dryad and then Bog myself. They left a card on top. They know I have Summoner's Pact in hand. Yeah, I'm going to make this play. It might be too conservative, but just if they left a card on top, They might have left a discard spell on top, knowing we had packed in hand, and then fetched it away. This Coligan's command? That'd be pretty bad. I mean, not like we could have played around this. I mean, this just has to grab Endurance now. So if we exile our graveyard, Tarmogoyfs become two. So we'd be taking one two, three, four, five. I guess we're not technically dead. Uh, oh, they have enchantment. So we specifically have to top deck exactly endurance to not be instantly dead. Because if we top deck endurance, we can theoretically exile their graveyard, which shrinks the groves. Yeah, we're dead. Okay, better luck game three.
opponent put on good pressure. Maybe I was supposed to play out the engineered explosives rather than the dryad just to get it on the table. Probably not. Then it just is exposed to Culligan's command or whatever. I think I played that fine. I think we were a little land light for a while. We're also on a mulligan. I'll keep this. I like this hand. Endurance is really good in this matchup, so... Um, like, any discard spell has to choose between two excellent cards, and we probably have an excellent turn three play. Yeah, I think any of these, there's an argument for each of these cards. I expect they'll take the endurance, but I could be surprised. Now, if they have another discard spell for the Azusa, uh, we just play attack land to set up for Karn. I want to hold a bounce land in hand. I think that there's a lot of value in having mana right now. I meant to dash that, but this is okay. I think I'll get the walking ballista with the plan to chump the goyf, and even if they kill the Ballista it gets to take the uh, Ragavan with it. Definitely missing Worm Coil Engine in this specific situation. Inquisition is what we want to see. Obviously our best draw is Primeval Titan. Bounce Land's also a reasonable draw. This off.
think this goif this goif needs to go to be mana efficient because I think I'm in a spot where I kind of need to be mana efficient to have a chance. I really need a Titan or a Bounce Land. That's rough. So now I guess Karn is our best draw, weirdly. Endurance would also be reasonable. I guess endurance. Endurance, we don't get the trigger for it entering, so it just blocks. Which is kinda sad, but the world we live in. That torpor orb just came right in time. Okay. Well, hopefully we're still at top eight. Um, we should have good breakers, so... Uh, we'll see how it goes.